I know that many yoga teachers, for example, they try to teach, they give lessons to these students to do breathing exercises, so they start to use the diaphragm. But usually for them, I know it takes uh, months, in many cases, years of practice. I mean, like in, every day you need like sit down, maybe one, two hours, practice your diaphragm, and then long, long time later you would achieve the result. So that at sleep, at rest, you don't think, and you breathe using the diaphragm. What I found with my students when I do breathing retraining course for them, when we start to improve the oxygen test result, you remember body oxygen test that we did with you, we'll do it very shortly soon. I found that when we start to increase the results and when we get up to 30 seconds of high numbers in the morning, you know, you imagine you wake up and you have 30 seconds of oxygen in the morning. Then at this stage, it's virtually all my students, they would automatically switch to diaphragmatic regardless of like we can be 30 years old we can be sometimes 50 70 years old and even older people they would probably breathe using chest for like last 30 years of their life or more and when we start we say like well i can't move the diaphragm i've seen many people like this many students who say like i can not even move my diaphragm even those people if we achieve this result with breathing retraining the body somehow changes itself and instead of having chest breathing day and night we start naturally breathing using the diaphragm. So that's uh, related to chest breathing and diaphragm.